What's up guys, Shuri here, and as you can see, my teammate didn't pick anything. He just randomly gets fort. That was kind of weird. Thing is, I didn't know that happened, and for some reason, I wasn't put into the game for the first 20 seconds. So, it, I just come out, there's like a shell right here, I am able to kill the shell. He did go invisible and then try to jump in front of me, and I was able to get him. It looks kind of weird on the replay, but for me, I saw the shell. And then we are going to kill the hunter. We know that there is a Jabali in there, so I go ahead and call that out. And I was telling Joper, hey dude, we got Jazuki back, we are going to be fine. And we just hear Mario start snoring. Because the thing is, before this game, there was a 40-minute queue because the rank systems broke. Luckily, they're going to fix it. But we had been playing for hours, so many long queues, and we were, like, watching videos and stuff in between. And so, like, we weren't talking or engaging with each other, and Mario just fell asleep. And so we just hear him snoring on the mic the whole time, which is really distracting. And, I mean, honestly, I mean, it's kind of rude. But what you going to do? He was asleep. It's not even his fault. So, basically, at this point, we know it's a bot. Because the bot's just being bot-like. It's getting stuck in corners and stuff. It's rough. And I know what you're thinking. Why would you post the video that you lose this bad in? And the answer is, we don't. I mean, the first round goes rough. I agree. It didn't work out too great. But they have a Jabali. It's 2v3. And I wasn't aware exactly that that was happening. And we were just laughing in Discord with a bunch of people as he was snoring. But what are you going to do? And we go down and we just do our best with a freaking bot fort, whatever. It's not, I'm not even mad. I'm a little mad. But, you know, I mean, it could be a worse character pick. Just watch round three. But we are going to be here and we are going to just do our best to get them when they come out so we have a little bit of advantage. I'm getting shot by the shell, so I know I'm dead. I'm just trying to put damage on the hunter. That way, Joper can get him, which is exactly what Joper did because he is a god. But I don't think we have the right characters for this, honestly. But we're going to try our best. Joper's busy, and I tell him, don't worry, I got the Jabali. You go ahead, do the guy in front of you. You are all good. And I get wrecked by that Walling. That Walling goes down, gets the headshot. What are you going to do? I mean, we are playing in the diamonds. Like, you're going to play good people. It is what it is. Especially since it's 2v3. But right here, we do actually get the lead. And we get the kill there on the Hunter. And we just have a little bit of cover. I am actually in a really bad spot. But I am able to go ahead and kill him. But now we have this guy capping on this shell and I just can't do anything about it because I can't go in there with no health He actually rushes me and I didn't notice But we do turn around and flick on him getting him low and our fort used his ult and actually got a kill on it So all I got to do is go here kill this guy No problem and we got the hill back at the end. We are good to go But there is a problem We're playing 2v3 <laughs> So, yeah, that's the problem. Either way, Joper and me are here, and I'm going to back up. That way, I can try to get the hunter. The biggest problem is that guy hit his reflection shield, which does get me, and I am just trying not to hit it, but I have to get that hill because it's 96 seconds, and what I'm going to do is have to go for the hunter first. Absolutely destroyed, but they're all three there. Nothing you can do. And luckily, I had Joper tell me, hey, man, there's nothing you can do. And that was really nice. Like, I, I like it. Um, I probably might have could have done something. But but he made sure that I felt like I, I did good. That was nice. So I go Scotty, and he goes Aletta. That's going to be huge. And, of course, the game picks Yaw for him, which actually I thought was a great thing. Because if you guys know anything about the bots in this game, they literally cannot get a kill Unless it is with their ultimate or special ability. That's why the hunter is so good. But, um, Yaw has like a dash. That's good, right? I do get nice two kills there. And Joper able to clean it up. And he's just able to stall time on the hill. And I didn't notice they switched to Johnny Jet. So I'm just like, what is going on here? I get him low. But we can't worry about the JJ actually. Because we have to worry about the others. We can just let him try to cap. And then we get back when we can. Right there. I do an awesome dance onto the shell. Getting the kill with two headshots. And now we just got to deal with this Johnny. I get him low. I do web just to get away. I don't really care if 
it hits him. I just needed the heal, but it didn't get to me because Joper took it, which is fine because he was doing such a great job on that hill that he actually allowed us to get 58 seconds of time. What a freaking legend, bro. I'm telling you. Right here, I get him low, and then I go ahead and get the JJ low, and then Joper doing work gets the kill. Everything I do, he finishes, which is exactly what the point of it is. He goes around, bees annoying, stays on that hill, and right here, our teammate, our bot teammate was in the hill, right? He walks out of it to go spawn kill them. What is this? I do a great job to kill the fort, even though our bot's an idiot and I hate him, but it's okay. We are able to go ahead and take them out after that. Joper doing an absolute amazing job right here. I do go kill the fort, but... We do have Joper going down to the Hunter. I do need to be careful here. I'm getting shot from both sides, and I do my best to kill the Hunter, which I do, even though I was getting slammed by the other guy. So we are going to still stay Hunter, even though they switched from the JJ. It is still a good character, and I think it's probably one of the ones I should choose. So right here, we are doing a great job to get these kills. We are getting everybody low. Joper goes in there, finishes them, and then we take the Cinder out with a Sonar Ball for 100% to go 1-1. One, one. What are they going to pick for this round? I hope it's a hunter. Oh no, I'm on hunter. Well, maybe it's something else that's good. Since they can only kill with abilities, it would be really bad if it's Vincent, the thing that only has defensive ability. Why? Why did they choose Vincent? Why? What is this? What did I do to get that? We are 1-1 one, one in Diamond, and you give me Vincent as my bot? You know, maybe it's not that bad. It is that bad, I promise. All right, but I am going to go on the right side, get this guy low for Joper, and then I get absolutely destroyed doing just a little bit of damage. But Joper, the god himself, goes ahead and kills the one that was full first, then gets the straggler that I made, and then he gets the hill. This man is an absolute legend. I'm telling you guys, this game was crazy. I mean, 2v3, and you have Mario snoring in the background, just distracting everybody, and, and then everybody's just laughing because we have multiple people in there just having a good time and right here we do just get that guy to drive back and i wonder if there's people coming and i swear to god the replay says i didn't hit him but on my screen i totally hit that guy i'm telling you but it's all good we do need to go ahead and watch for the shell he has one shot he's dead and then we can move on to that jabali he gets the heal but i almost got his shields i tell joper hey man just go ahead kill that guy and then we're gonna rush that hunter and that's exactly what we do so so the biggest advantage that Vincent gave us, the hunter tried to double back and do something sneaky, but the Vincent's thing that tells us where he is, I have no idea what this Vincent's doing. I mean, he got ulted here too, so it is what it is. We do kill the shell through the ult, but I'm so screwed there. Luckily, Joper is still keeping the hill, and we have 48 seconds. I'm going in to help him, because the biggest thing Joper's doing is he's living, and I come in, and I get the damage, then he goes into attack mode. And that's what makes him one of the best pros in the world, is he knows when to go Aletta and then stay into attack mode, or does he just need to jump Jump around and live. He's doing a perfect job of living whenever I die, and then when I come back, we kill everybody. And it's a cycle that goes over and over, and that is why we're able to 2v3 even these players in Diamond and Platinum. It is just what it is. Right here, we do have this guy going back. We are doing a great job. We're going to kill him. Joper dies here, and he tells me to be careful, but I'm like, nah, man, I got this triple. And then the hunter does a glitch to try to do something stupid, and that guy's an idiot, and back. Just saying. If you know, you know. But we are going to have him run into a wall because of that, because he realizes the game's about to end. So that means he's probably out of the game, and we are going to be able to just play it 2v3, no problem, easy mode. Let's go, and we are going to go ahead kill this guy. He's got a teammate, so I'm just going to run away from him. <laughs> it worked out great. They do come out this side, and I'm just going to go ahead and knock him back and kill him before he hits the ground. Let's go. And we have Joper in the hill. He finishes off the Jabali that I got low earlier, and we go ahead and get the win. And we did such a great job going 8-3, and 11-2. We both had insane damage, and we did an insane job. And that guy... He was down in two at one point. I mean, these guys weren't the easiest in the world, but I had Choper on my team. You cannot lose. 
even if Jazuki falls asleep in the middle of the game. But it was a 40-minute queue. You cannot blame the guy for falling asleep when he has to wait 40 minutes for one ranked match. But they're fixing the ranking system, and it's actually looking like it's going to be great. But not as great as Jordy's thumbnail. Look how good this guy is. He's an absolute artist that is so good that you need to hire him for yourself. Luckily, you can. Go to my description, get his info, and you can have thumbnails from Jordy as well. Alright guys, have a great day.